Hey, if you've clicked on this YouTube video, you've just entered Steph Gump's YouTube channel. Congratulations! I hope you have a great time. I'm joking. I'm joking. Come on, come in. Hey, how you doing? And welcome back to my channel, guys. Welcome back to my channel. To all my new subscribers, welcome to my channel. You don't know. So today I'm back with a new video. I'm actually just gonna go straight into it. This video is gonna be the 10 things I hate about YouTubers and YouTube. The reason why I'm doing this video is I was watching a video on like over the weekend, I was watching a video and it just triggered so many things for me. Like when I tell you, it was just a triggering video and it just made me think about all the little things that piss me off about YouTubers. For those who are wondering, who is she? Who is she to be? To be saying this who cares i don't care yeah this is my opinion these are my reasons why these things annoy me and i'm just gonna get right to it yeah if you want to watch the rest of the video please get comfortable and let's get to the video so the number one thing that i hate about youtubers and i think i can speak for everybody for everybody on this is clickbait click Babe. nobody understands how much I hate this with a passion like with a passion like someone can make such a wavy thumbnail the thumbnail will look good like one of them was where it's like yeah I need to click I need to watch this so when you watch the video it's one dry ass <laughs> I even need to say dry ass video like it's so boring like and I just don't get it I just don't get it like I don't think YouTube can be that deep for views that let's say your thumbnail was for example let's say for example your thumbnail was a man slitting a girl's throat a bit yeah but let's just say for example so this guy's slitting a girl's throat and then you click the video this time it's a father and daughter go to the park like it, I just I hate it so much American YouTubers are very guilty of doing clickbait as well. A lot of American YouTubers. I was watching a video from this YouTuber, um, American YouTuber, and the thumbnail was her crying. Like, in the thumbnail was her crying, it is bawling, proper bawling. But when you click the video, it was a vlog, a normal day to day vlog. And the last five, the last five seconds of her video was her crying. But do you want to know why she was crying? Because she couldn't open a can of coke. I sat down and watched the whole 17 minutes just to find out that she couldn't open a can of coke. That's why she was crying. That stop with the clickbait, the semen titles. And uh, nah, the semen titles, it merges with the clickbait as well. Don't tell people that this is what happened when this is what really happened. For example, a lot of YouTubers, not a lot, but some YouTubers are guilty of telling, for example, story time. Their story time would be, my Uber driver tried to kidnap me. So you're thinking, these times when they turned the story, it was just that your Uber driver took the wrong route and you were scared. That was, that's it. No to clickbait. Second thing that annoys me about YouTubers, Instagram girls, who think that they can jump on YouTube and that's it because they've got their followers from Instagram and that that they'll back you on YouTube and do absolute nonsense. Now I'm talking about the Instagram girls that are paying, paying, but they, they jump on YouTube to try and be funny. Listen. No. I, if you're jumping on YouTube, I would understand if you're doing a YouTube video on makeup, beauty, hair, something, you know, like that. But when you're trying to be funny, it's just cringe to watch that. Like, it's just like, I liked you when you were just taking pictures pretty and shit. Do you know what I mean? So that's, that's, I just hate, I actually hate Instagram girls, paying for Instagram girls that jump on YouTube with no substance. Like, they've just come on because they've got followers on Instagram. You're on, you're actually on YouTube for the wrong reason. Stay on, stay on Instagram. Third thing that annoys me about YouTubers and YouTube are people like people who are recording a youtube video and then obviously they have a friend in their background but instead of talking to the camera you're talking to your friend 
and it's not even anything related to the video it would be along the lines of this what are you doing why are you stop it the store i'm trying to record do you like do you like it i think i look a bit weird like no stop it am i here to watch your conversation with your brother or have i come to watch you how are you talking like i don't get it i hate it just focus on the camera like, i don't think it's professional like why like you can and the worst thing about it is these things you can edit it out why have you decided to slap the content of you talking to whoever you're talking to in the video just doesn't make sense to me don't don't number four thing that pisses me off youtubers like this point can go either way so it could be this way or that way so youtubers who always come back on their youtube channel and it's always hi guys i'm back oh sorry i've been gone and um, blah 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 now this is what i mean that it can go either way this and that one the youtubers that are like and then we won't see another video for them for another two months then they'll come back saying i'm back same excuse this is the reason why i left let's just leave it out stop it stop it the reason why i could go this way as well are those youtubers who would say i'm back every other week allow us to miss you like why is every day i'm back after two weeks i'm back come back come back come back i think it's number five but number five fake youtubers like this topic we can go on all day but fake youtubers guys and you already know what type of youtubers i'm talking about i'm talking about the youtubers that just care about sponsorships who you can read that they're f like this is not their personality just by watching them on youtube and you know that's so bad if i can read that you're fake through the camera and i don't know you but there's so many fake youtubers that are on youtube for the wrong reason like fair enough youtube are people like some people's day jobs and that but if you flipping are just there for the sponsorships you know and like you're just there for the no reason like for the wrong reason like youtube actually is supposed to be a fun place like when i used to fall in love with youtube like seven years ago eight years ago like youtube was just fun like it wasn't about no sponsorships nothing like that like not every single video was based on the sponsorship like i'm not gonna lie someone like patricia back I only learnt about Patricia Bright this year when she, well it was this year when she got a million followers Then I watched her old videos and I was thinking okay this is the reason why she got a million followers Because she's like, she's interested in it Ow! I watched like, I would see her videos on my YouTube feed and it's like Get this from Amazon, get this from Argos, get this from Boots What's in my bag, pretty little thing, misguided, blah 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 like, like I like with the sponsorships, like I get it, like I get it, everyone's on the grind, everyone has a hustle and everything like that, but every single video is sponsorship, come on B, come on. I think that also hate people who will have like a 10 minute video and they've slapped 6 ads in the middle of their video, why are you doing that? Because I will actually come off the video, not that I watch the video 30 seconds in, we're already into a 30 second advert as well, not even the ones where, oh skip ads after 5 seconds, 30 seconds ad that you just want me to sit and watch watch another one minute of your video next that i'm clicking off the ads i made the video i'm clicking it off there's, there's just no way number six that annoys me about youtube this might sound really mad like it sounds like but i do it too but people who always say subscribe okay like i know i'm a youtuber i want subscribers everybody wants subscribers but you know one of them people that will play sub say subscribe every moment they can get like one minute supposed to subscribe second minute into the video they put up a pop-up that says subscribe fourth minute into the video there's a pop-up subscribe there pop-up subscribe there that like, we get it we want if we, if i want to subscribe i'll subscribe that's why i always say at the end of my videos if you want to it's not by force because it's actually not by force do you get what i mean like subscribe if you like me subscribe if you see something that you like about me i don't force the people get me seven point people who are bare fidgety in their videos like i can't stand it i'm talking about like constantly playing with the hair 
looking at the monitor instead of the camera screen like it adds to the fidgetiness because you're looking at your hair you're playing the hair looking at the monitor when you should be looking here fixing your jacket with the time that like, we can just see that you're just looking at yourself type of thing like just feel like if you're coming on camera and you're getting ready to do youtube prepare yourself like make sure everything is calm like see me now have i fidgeted once in this video I'm taking it easy, chilling back. Like, I know I look calm. I'm fidgetiness, leave it. Like, just, just. Because when you someone is fidgety on screen, I now become fidgety, and it's just like. Stop it. Number eight. This is. <laughs> this is a random, a really random take. But I hate, I can't stand people who randomly dance. <laughs> I can't stand people who randomly dance in the middle of their video to show that they're like they're lit or they're exciting or they're fun. Do you get what I'm saying when I say this? Like, let me show you the example. Hi guys, welcome to my channel. What are you doing? Like, do you know how many people I've stumbled across on YouTube and they'll just randomly throw in a dab mid-sentence and then they'll be like, hey! I don't think so, so are you doing this to show that you're lit or to show that this is personality because I just I don't get it <laughs> number nine force collabs I can't force collabs no I think that needs to stop because like from when viewers obviously I'm a YouTube viewer even though I'm a YouTuber I am a YouTube viewer and from when I can sense that collab is fake, a fake or forced collab just for views, just because the other person like, gets views or has more subscribers, you're just with them for the image basically. That's a forced collab. That is really a full forced collab. That's like me doing a collab video with KSI, if I, I think that's his name. If I do a collab video with KSI, that's forced. I don't like, I don't like gaming the way he does, do you get what I mean? So me being on his channel, or him being on my channel collabing, is just a bit irrelevant. Unless he's doing like a special where he's playing games with YouTube. Do you get where I'm coming from though? Like, just force collab, it's just not that deep to me. It's just not that deep. Sorry. <laughs> 10th point. 10th point. This is going to be the most hypocritical point. <laughs> this is going to be the most hypocritical point because I'm guilty of this and I do it all the time. But I don't care because if you know me, I don't do it on purpose really. <laughs> Number 10 is fake American accents. Please, please, please. I know I sound like the biggest hypocrite right now, but sometimes, yeah, it's just so jarring. And if I do this and it jars you, then I'm sorry, but I'm not going to change, obviously. But it's so, so annoying. It just doesn't sound cute at all, like, at all. And yeah, like I know that's a hypocritical point and I do it all the time. I just I just can't stand it. Why are you doing that? Why? But yeah guys, that was my 10 things I hate about YouTube and YouTubers. I hope you enjoyed this video. Obviously this there was no actual indirects in this video because I would add the people. I added Patricia right there. <gasps> but um I hope you enjoyed this video. Continue to like, comment and subscribe if you want. I'm not forcing you in it. <laughs> Follow me on all my socials as well. My Twitter, my Instagram and my Snapchat is all Steph Gump. You know why already. I say it every single week. We a franchise, baby. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. This was just a little quick. This was just one of them videos that was in my head. So I just had to let that lay out. So. Hope you enjoyed. See you in the next one. Bye. <laughs> what? No. I am actually a delight. I'm a fucking delight, bitch. <laughs>